in your mind as you're driving at the pad site, would you have a drive up song? To get to that moment where I'm sitting in the seat, buckled in, and that countdown's beginning. Three, two, one. I imagine what it's going to feel like physically in terms of lifting off from the surface of the earth. It's hard for it to always seem completely real. Then a whole other chapter opens and a whole other adventure begins. I'm very excited to start my training. I've been waiting for a long time. The anticipation's been killing me. And now here we are today. I'm ready. As a proud Canadian, it was important to me to really highlight Canadian universities and Canadian research institutions and to give opportunities to those researchers and those organizations that they might not otherwise have. Mark was entirely committed to developing this mission as a scientific mission. And the theme of the mission was caring for the planet, caring for its people. We're going to be testing new technologies that can help us explore space, staying longer and going farther, but more importantly, can help change our lives here on Earth. There will be a lot of physical and psychological studies that uh, I'll be participating in up there. A lot of the research that I'm undertaking involves uh, using me as a lab rat because that's uh, that's the best way I can contribute. A lot of what one experiences in space, in terms of inflammation, in terms of pain, psychological feelings of isolation, those are things that affect sick kids. To me, I would like to think that I'll leave this world a better place than I found it. The crew is setting a high standard for private astronauts in the future because they're dedicated to science, they're dedicated to the mission, they're able to learn all these objectives, they are building in educational outreach. It's really exciting watching this come together. I'm very excited to work with you to complete your science experiments and your educational outreach when you get on board ISS. We know you guys are prepared and we'll be supporting you here from Mission Control in Houston. There's a lot of people, some that I know and many that I don't that uh, deserve my appreciation and thanks and gratitude for getting me here. I'm Mark Pathy and I'm a mission specialist on AX-1.